I'm Michael Fuller. I'm a junior here at Hofstra University. I'm doing a BA, MA in journalism with a minor in drama. And my goal career, I would hope to be able to aspire to be a reporter, anchor in the journalism field. I had the great opportunity, the fantastic opportunity of hosting Fall Fest with Rachel Ann. Uh, so uh, we went around and shot a video for Hofstra Media Relations and it was a blast. We pretty much covered all the events from the performances to the fireworks, um, from standing outside with Kathy Griffin and it was just I mean it was just a blast I think people who watch that video will be able to really kind of get a feel of what Hofstra Fall Fest 2014 was like through that video so it was fantastic um, from a communication standpoint I've had the awesome opportunity of being involved in a lot of shows <laughs> there's just a lot to do uh, I'm the entertainment producer and reporter and writer for Hofstra Today which is our news magazine show that we have on every other Wednesday here on campus um, I'm also the host of a show called For Your Island I've hosted Director's Cut which is a show that's kind of like inside the actor studio uh, but we tailor it to our film directors here on on campus uh, so that's a lot of fun I'm a part of WRHU which is the number one college radio station in the nation uh, that's pretty exciting to be a part of that uh, I do our morning show I do news updates as an anchor uh, I host a show called Jazz Cafe one of our music shows I participate in Newsline doing traffic and weather uh, also trying to start a new show and get that on the airwaves so hopefully uh, that comes through uh, I also work with the mascot team uh, as a sub captain uh, working with our team to be able to to produce good events and get our mascots out there and also work with Hofstra Gospel Ensemble. So it's a lot to do on campus, but it's uh, it's all good stuff. Right now as a junior, I'm applying for internships in the city, you know, to hopefully to be able to do that uh, with those communications, specifically communications internships. But I had the amazing opportunity as a sophomore to be able to go to uh, Orlando, Florida and work with the Walt Disney Company at Walt Disney World doing an internship. It's called the Disney College Program. You live, learn, earn. So you go there, you live at Walt Disney World, you live at Walt Disney World. Um, you earn and you're able to earn money because you work for the company in a particular role in the park or in an office doing a professional internship and then you learn because you are able to take classes from uh, Disney accredited professors and be able to just learn about the company and how your academic background in school could tie in with the Walt Disney Company and it was just fantastic you know I worked in the entertainment department uh, as a character performer I also got a chance to work with the communications department doing some things with our show called called WKMK. Uh, it's a news radio program for Magic Kingdom. So that was awesome. So right now I'm pursuing uh, the dual degree program to graduate with my undergrad with journalism and then the following year to do the same with the graduate um, degree. It's been, it's been a real blast. I mean, I've had some really fantastic professors who've not only been able to guide me with the work that they give in class, but who have had that experience on the outside world. I mean, I think it's important to be able to teach journalism but if you have that experience in working at CBS or working uh, in print or working in radio, I applied and I came here to visit and then after that I fell in love with it and it became my number one. I think the thing that really got me was that the people were just so kind. They were so kind. Um, I also got the, the benefits of being, uh, being able to go into the city without having to live in the city. But plus, um, I mean, just the experience, the Lawrence Herbert School of Communication, I mean, everything we use from the news up to the radio station is top-notch technology. And to be able to have that hands-on experience, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Hofstra really has prepared me from my future in a standpoint of, in terms of my academics and professional career, it's given me the right mix of classes. Uh, in terms of my professional career, I've been able to come in contact with not only my professors, but so many professionals who are still in the industry um, and be able to talk to them, whether it's in seminars, whether it's in workshops, whether they just come to to just visit. Uh, we've had a lot of that here and I've been able to take advantage of those opportunities in terms of internships. Again, we're right next to the number one media market in the world, so that has been fantastic. It allowed me to go down to do the Disney College program, which has always been my dream. Um, but, you know, from an overall standpoint, I would see it's, it's helped me to be and to see the world in a better way. You know, here on campus, 
It's a very diverse campus, and it's a very welcoming campus. I grew up in a very diverse environment. I grew up with African Americans, Caucasians,、uh, Asians. I mean, I grew up with everything, and I loved that. And I wanted a campus that mirrored what society had already looked like for me. And I think this campus mirrors that. It mirrors what the world looks like. And we're very, we're very tolerant here. You know, we we let. People grow and explore and really find their way on campus, and it kind of helps us and opens the door to be able to do that in the actual world.